I hope you guys can hear me, but this is a different set of grapes. See these climbers here? Hopefully you can see that, how it twirls around and around. All right, and this leaf shape of this grape. See the jagged edges here, the teeth? Well, here are some of the unripe grapes. Let's see if I can get to them here. Now, I put a video up and I asked you before, and this is the same kind of grapes, although this is a different grape. This is a different area, so these are different grapes. They're not the same grapes, but it is the same kind of grape. Now, what this is, is a muscadine and wild grape mix. These were brought over into the United States, and these were introduced grapes that were here, and, or excuse me, that were brought over here and escaped into the wilds and mingled with other wild grapes in the United States, and it is a muscadine wild grape hybrid is what it is, all right? So let me show you one of the leaves. Now, these leaves are all different sizes, but see the, see the teeth on the edges? You can look these up. Now, these will get dark purpley black when they're ripe. They're green right now. Okay. When you pop it open, these have these have three to, I think these just have three or four seeds in them. But depending on the kind, some of them can have one seed up to eight different seeds inside this little grape, depending on the size of the grape and the kind of, of grape. This is a completely edible, and you can eat these small leaves. Taking these small leaves while they're tender and rolling up rice and other things in them. Uh, any recipe for grape leaves, you can use these for. Of course, the grapes themselves make wonderful uh, wine and other things like that. There's, there's seeds in there, so eating them is kind of, you know, it, it, sometimes it's an acquired taste on what you like. Well, there are certain things you have to look for in the wild grapes, but to answer everybody's question, the grapes that I asked you about before, I asked, are they edible? What kind are they? It was actually a hybrid muscadine and wild grape mix. It's a hybrid grape, and yes, it is edible from the leaves to the grapes themselves. All right, I thank you for watching.